Hello. We're going to show you how to log in to the back end of your app. To do so, you will go to our website, yourmobileschoolapp.com. You will click on the menu on the top right. You will click on Login. Here is where you'll type in your app code, which will be provided to you. Right now, we're just going to log into our demo one to show you. Once you log in, it's going to take you to the overview section, which shows you recent activity, top users, sessions by device. Now, the main sections of the back end are the create section, which is where you can actually build your app, which that has all the tabs that make up your actual app. There is also the design section, which will control the graphics and how it looks so you can have different colors of your tabs as well as the background and anything else design wise. The manage section is where you can get the app analytics to see how many people has actually looked at your app, what section they view. The push notifications which is one of the most important sections which is where you will send out messages to everybody that has your app downloaded. The transaction section is where data is stored from the forms that are filled out. The grow section is the promote section, which is to help promote your app out to everybody to help them get everybody to download it. The settings section is where if you want to enable the membership feature, you can set this up and it will actually allow you to create members if you want to have give different people different access to different parts of your app. So if you want teachers to have a certain area, if you want kids and students to have a different area, if you want the parents to have a different area, and so also it relates to messages when you send messages to everybody. This of course is the preview section. Now you can always see what your app looks like. Up here will be the support. You click on here. It's the name of your school. You'll click account. And you can always come in here, change your email address to the email that needs to be. Your name, so this would be the school name and your telephone number for the school. And then one of the main important features right here is under menu. If you click on work order, Anything that's on your app that you can't figure out how to do, if you're having trouble with, if you want something changed, or if honestly you do not have the time to do it and you just want us to do it. So if you have a bus schedule or an athletic schedule, you can come right here, fill out this information, ask us to put it in there for you, and we'll put it in there right away for you within 24 to 48 hours, and there's no extra charge. This is all included. So definitely use the work order anytime you have anything you need done on the app. And that is the first step of the video. I will now take you through the rest of the app in the following videos.